runner as same to the j meter. Uh, load runner as same to the j meter. So load runner, how many components we discuss? How many Hello, components? Virtual user generator, okay. controller, and analyzer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Agent process and load Agent generator also. Load generator. Total five components in load runner. So virtual user generator and controller and agent process and load generator and analyzer. Okay. Lakshmi, what is a virtual user generator? It reports the script to and it generates the script for statements. Okay, good. Pavani, what is controller? Yeah, controller is a user to create virtual user and execute the uh, test with multiple users. Okay, what is the uh, agent process, uh, Basha? Connection between controller and Connection between controller and load generator. Sir. Okay, Banu, what is load generator? Load generator is to communicate. Banu. Generator uh, again is the uh, application. Load uh, again is application. Okay. Chandana, what is the analyzer? Uh, analyzer is. Yeah, analyzer is just and to find out the. Find out the bugs, it is called bottlenecks. Yeah. So, so using these uh, five components, we can do for the end to end testing, right? So, first thing is the, what is the virtual user generator means uh, we can record the script and do the some script announcements. Uh, so, for example, already we discussed that right? we have the any application. So, so we have the for example we have the like flight book up flight booking is the one of the application. So in that flight book application, what things we can do? Open the flight application and click on flights and select for the source and destination. And uh, we need to enter for the passenger details. Please mute yourself. Uh, please mute yourself. Okay. So these are will be our business application. Like we need to record the script means first thing we should understand the business flow. Means for example, we are booking the flight. So in the book, the flight means what is the transactions will be there, what we can do. Once we need to open the first thing is the flight application. And after that, we need to log in the application, right? Log in the application. And after that, we can click on the flights and we need to select for that source and destination like departure and the arrival cities and after that we need to enter for the passenger details like passenger first name last name and address and passenger city and sm to credit card details so these all things we need to mention in the payment details and log out with one of the transaction so using this scenario we need to record using for the scripting point of view we need to which tool we can use which component virtual user generator so uh, starting we should so i'm showing how to we can record the script and everything and uh, how to open for the this uh, web tour application means please go through for everyone actually first you need to web tour everyone install means you need to go to the first will be extract the web tour application once you can extract the web tour application you can see this uh, so this is the extracted this will be zip file this is the extracted file so you need to open the extracted file and uh, in that you can open web tour for here once you can open the first time you need to install for the strawberry everyone able to see strawberry this thing you need to install first thing so you can double click and click on next next it will automatically complete it then after installation completed this is the start server actually the web tour application they developed for the only testing point of view to practice for the testing point of view they developed for the web tour application so we need to open the web tour application means you should be start the server start 
one you you not start the server the web tour application will be not in work so for example we will see it will open or not because of now i am not open uh, not uh, open this start server right so i am entering for the web tour application url so this is the web tour application so now you can observe everyone see we are unable to log into the application see we are getting for the refuse to connect because of the server is not connected so that is why you are getting for this error so that is why you are recording for the web tour application means each and every time you need to go to the web tour and after that you need to see for the, this is the start server you need to click on start server so this window will open it's a command window no need to anything do just you can minimize you can keep it and after that now you can go to the application now you can enter now you can observe see we are able to access our web tour application so you are doing for the web tour application means you should be start the server that is the first thing as same to you are doing for first time web tour application you should must be install for the starberry payroll is there right you can just uh, click on double click and it will ask for the next 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 it will finish and after that is only you need to open for the start server okay everyone clear this is the basic point maybe you need to record the script means you need to follow these steps okay so once we can open this now uh, this is the business flow right already i told right what is the business flow this is the flight booking application what is this application name web tour so this script we need to record the script means uh, first thing you should understand the business flow so i am entering for the login details jojo and bean and uh, so this is the login transaction we are clicking for the login transaction and after that we are need to booking the flight means you need to click for the flights button this is the flights button and uh, this is the you need to where to where to go means that what is the departure city what is the arrival city means you are currently is a london to you are going to as a select for the any city i am going to as a london to paris and the date will be this date only so that is why i am not changing if you want to change means you can edit and you can there and book the ticket for example you want to give for the 4 and 26 you are booking so you need to give so this will be format will be month and date and year format okay and after that this is the number of passengers you need to give for the one means you can give one or you want two means you can give for the two details so right out now i'm giving for the one user and uh, for seating preference also you need to select for the anyone it depends on the your preference and types of seat also you need select that is the first our uh, business coach so you need to select this okay and uh, you can once you can select for the departure cities and this all things then you need to click on continue button this is the flights so we have the different flights will be there so you need to select for the flight which flight you want depends on the cost depends on the time you need select any one of the flight and click on continue and after that you need to enter for the details of the payment details so you need to uh, book the ticket means we should pay the money then only it is the ticket will be successfully done so this is the payment transaction so you need to give for the address like uh, i am giving for the street address mayapur and city i am giving for the hyderabad okay and uh, credit card details i am entering for the 1 2 3 4 6 and expiry date i am entering so this all details will be mandatory you need to give because of you need to give for the some payment details means these all details will be we need so what is the passenger first name last name and what is city and what are the these things and the passenger name details and you need to give for the credit card details to do the payment means we need to give the credit card details and then after that you can continue so now you can observe thank you for booking through web tour application means we are web tour application will be successfully ticket booking is completed so after ticket booking is completed means what we can do we need sign up right then we don't have anything then you need to sign up so this is our business flow for this business flow we need to record the script using for the virtual user generator now you are clear right everyone what is the our business flow oh, yeah, yes, this is yes, only sir. for flight booking 
Yes, yes. Only for flight booking. For example, you are doing okay. is in that you are doing is a uh, uh, like a Facebook application. For example, so Facebook means what things we can do? Enter name or password. Yeah, enter the password. That is called as a login section, login transaction. Okay. After that, we need to upload video and download video and charting and logout. Charting. So, before you need to record the script means you should understand what is the business flow because while recording the script you come to the back and these things will be it will not work because of the code will be uh, not recorded properly if you come to back and again you enter any mistake means you need to record again so that is why before recording the script what is our business flow you should understand then only you can record for successfully otherwise uh, for example now is a flight booking will be there logging means okay everyone can do it that is fine right and after click on login so you need to book the flight means you need to select click the flight but you don't know the business flow then you can click on itinerary that will be different transaction right so that is why you should be understand the what is our business flow so that is why you should be do for the business flow you should understand first thing so uh, everyone understand right what is the business flow and uh, we can call it as uh, this all each and everyone is a uh, one transaction flight booking application open and login is a one transaction upload video one transaction and download is a one transaction and chatting is a one transaction and logout also one transaction and as same to in for example this is the flight application open the flight book application that is a one transaction after that login is a one transaction click on flights is a one transaction and after that we are selecting for the source and destination details that is also one transaction after that we are giving for the passenger details and credit card details that is a one transaction and payment details and logout so we are doing for the each and every transactions what are the transactions which transactions we can do critical business transaction means which pages are mostly accessing the users those also we can call it as a transactions so everyone clear right what is the business flow and what is the transactions also yes yes sir see anyone have any doubts please ask me because of uh, don't keep it to your side uh, okay please ask me please clear your doubts then only you will give me next class will be fine you are uh, what will be in your point your packet you will be every time will be your thinking what is that you know? so that is why please if anyone have any doubts please ask me no problem okay because of this section is it you should be understand for each and everyone you should understand then only we'll go to the next class means you can understand okay so now can you is the business flow is fine right now we need to record the script means using for the this is the we discuss right virtual user generator using this virtual user generator we need to record the script so now you need to open this virtual user generator and uh, yes so once open this uh, we will able to see right uh, this is the once open by the virtual user generator it will open like this this is the recent activity means what are the scripts as of now you done everything will be show like this so these all will be existing scripts and uh, you can see this uh, what's new means for this uh, uh, okay this uh, current load runner 2021 release what are the new things they features added everything will be there so you need to go through that and you need to see okay and after that now we are to create for the new script means you need to go to the files and select for the new script and solution it is कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन दि टूल अंडेशन सो दट इज वै वी कैन सेलेक्ट फॉर दब्लिकेशन वी आर डूंग मीन वेबिकेशन मीन लाइट बुकिंग इज अब्लिकेशन फेसबुक इज अब्लिकेशन and icc bank and insurance application these all will web application so you can do for the testing performance testing any web application you should be select for the web http html and you after you can select the web http html then you are come to the script name already i told right 
you need to give for the proper script name. Which application we are doing? Flight booking. No, no, application I'm asking. That is the flight booking is a scenario. Web tour. Web, 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 web tour. Yes, Sorry. that's good. Web tour. And underscore, now you need to give for the which scenario you are doing. We are booking the flight booking, right? You can give for the flight booking. And after that, we need to give for that date of that. I'm giving just to today date. So you can give for the script name also. Some professional way you need to give. So, for example, we are doing for the test booking application. So anyone can tell me professional way how to write the script name. So Facebook. you need to you need Facebook. to give for the Facebook. Yeah. Facebook underscore underscore uh, uh, details. Facebook details. Yeah, Facebook details are you can upload the uh, upload video, maybe download video, you also different scenario. So you need to give for that and you need to give for the release date. So this is where you need to give for the script name. And after that, this is will be this script will be saving for this location. We use on scripts, it is a saving so now you need to click on create button okay once we can click on create button it will open like this and after that you need to start recording means this is the record button so just you can everyone able to see right just you can click on this record button once click the record button the pop-up window will open like this and you need to select for the Web, web application we are doing that is why you are selecting web browser and you need to select for the application nothing but this is the like uh, you are um, uh, this is for the browser which browser we need to use promo or internet explorer mozilla firefox or which one you need to select and after that this is the url so this url will be which application this is the web tour application so for example you are doing for the Facebook application, you are creating for the script for Facebook application. So you are, which URL we need to give? Facebook URL. Facebook URL. For example, you are doing for the any Instagram application, you can give for the www.instagram application. You are doing any ICC bank application, you can give for the www. Means in any application, you are doing for the any application that will be healthcare, whatever maybe. What are the URL they will provide for our uh, team lead or our okay our client so we need to take that url and we need to copy and paste it here okay it's clear right up to now and after that you need to click on start record button so automate no need to open manually automatically which browser you are selected that browser will be open which browser i selected Web to no, 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 I am asking about internal browser. Internal, internal, explorer. Internal, explorer. internal explorer. Yes. Internal so explorer. which browser I selected that only it is open. So now you need to perform your transaction. Now we are doing which transaction? This is web flight booking. Flight booking. Transaction name. It's a login or it is a flight booking. What is login. this? Login. 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 First was login. Yes, so now you are doing for the login means we have to give for the transaction names also. So where we can give the transaction name is this is the start transaction. So you need to everyone able to see insert start transaction. So you can click on this start transaction. Now you need to give for the transaction name. Transaction name also we need to give for the proper like web tour application. And uh, after that underscore, what is the transaction name? Login. Login. login login so you need to give for the login and this is the uh, which transaction first one second one first one no not the second one because already launch is happen launch is already automatically done so that is why this is the second transaction that is why i'm giving for the t02 transaction 02 and after that you need to once enter completed you need to click on this and uh, for example you want to give for the Flight booking means you can give for the FB. I'm giving for the scenario name means web tour flight booking in that transaction name login. This is the transaction T02. And after that, click on OK. Now you need to perform transaction login details. You need to give for the login details. Uh, like this application is a default username password will be Jojo and Bean. What is that? Jojo and Bean. B E A N. And after that, 
click on login button so login transaction is completed right yes sir so you yes, need sir. to stop the uh, end the login transaction this is the end transaction so starting we are entered here start transaction this is the end transaction now you need to click on end transaction you need to end for this web to underscore login transaction you can end it. now what is that next transaction flight book find click flight on flights. yes flight. click on flights so you need to give for the so uh, click on flights and underscore i'm giving for the t03 and okay. click it and after that now you can click on this so you can observe before starting i am giving for the start and once i click this completed then i will end this transaction so this is the proper recording so you everyone should understand okay now you can click on flags so now once you can click on flags so each and everyone you should wait for the some time because of it is uh, entire page will be loaded you need to wait some time and after that you need to start end the transaction name so click on flight transaction i am ending and now what we are doing find flight find flight so you need to give for the transaction name what find flight find find flight and underscore this is the 04 right t04 yeah and give and now you need to select for the departure city and arrive city you can select anything okay and uh, i'm in and after that you need to change for the date this all things means you can change it now i am clicking for the continue so after that you need to give for the different transaction means you can give otherwise this is also find flight only right yes so yes. no need to end this transaction because of we are doing only find flight only right that is why you need to select any one of the flight and click on continue so now find flight is completed so now you can go to here you can end this transaction now what the transaction we are doing payment details payment, payment details. details yes you need to give for the payment details like this is a transaction you can click on this enter this and you need to give for the t05 click on okay now you need to give for the address street address i'm giving for the mayapur and hyderabad so you can give for you anything no problem okay so i'm giving for the credit card details and expiry date m0123 and uh, after that now you can click on continue so which transaction is completed payment flight payment flight is completed now you need to end the transaction this is the end and after that now what is our last transaction sign off sign off so before click on that we need to enter for the sign off or log out whatever maybe you can give log out p06 and click on okay now we need to click on sign off button so our entire business flow is completed now you need to end the transaction before stop the recording this is the stop recording button you need to end the end transaction log out so our entire business flow is recorded successfully now what we can do we need to stop recording this is the stop recording button everyone able to see stop record button yes. now you can click on stop yes, recording so automatically code will be generated no need to write for the manual so everything code will be generated now you can go to the action you can click on action then enter code will be it is generated now you can observe we are given for the transaction names see this is the start transaction web to login see, here it started and after this is the ended so means this code will be it is generated in this start and end transaction in between you can observe i given for the jojo bin which transaction this will be login transaction login. and after that what we done click on flights see right. this is the click on flights started and dead and after that you can observe this is the find flight it is a started we are enter for the so departure and arrive city and after that we are selected flight also find flight 
transaction. So this is the flight. We have selected flight uh, number is a 242. 102 is a cost dollars and this is the date. And uh, after find flight completed, which transaction we done? Payment. We are given for the address one, address two, credit card details and uh, deposit expire date of the credit card. This is the which transaction? Payment transaction. So it is ended here. And after that, logout is started and the logout is done. So everything is a code recorded successfully, right? With yes, the start yes, and end transaction in between. So maybe you miss any one of the transaction. Maybe you are not, uh, uh, by mistakely, you are not uh, ended transaction. So you need to give for the transaction name means we can give for the manually also because of I missed read T01. So this is the which transaction launch URL. So this is the start transaction. This is the end transaction. Now you need to click on the start transaction. So the function name is what is the start transaction? LR underscore start underscore transaction. Here in double colon, you need to give for the transaction name. Launch web tour URL underscore T01. And what are you are given here transaction name and transaction as also we need to give that is why you need to copy and end where it will come. See, this is started means it will end here, right? So now this is the end transaction. Now you need to click on end transaction. So once click on end transaction, you need to copy and paste it. So maybe you miss any transaction like this, you can manually also enter. So as a real time employee, you need to record the script means you need to record like this. You need to give for the must to be start transaction end transaction. So now everything is done right now. Just you can execute once how the script is uh, execute. Now you can observe runtime viewer. It is the uh, initializing means what is going. Everything is uh, done executed. So now you need to observe for the results. So what are the transactions you are given? All the transactions will be displayed here. Everyone able to see launch and uh, flight to log book login and click on flights and find flight and payment logout. So now you can observe this is the response time. Measure our job will be one user how much time it is taking. This is the hours, minutes, seconds, microseconds. Yes. Okay. So is a less than one second means 311 milliseconds only it is happening for the one user point of you can see here status it is showing only one user execution so majorly we need to concentrate for these transactions each and every transaction we can execute with the 100 users what is the response time of this now you can observe we are executed only single user you are observed this one right now we need to execute with the more users like uh, okay you can discuss later uh, run logic i'm giving for the uh, 10 iterations okay i'm saving now i'm executing already we discussed right uh, uh, iteration nothing but for example this uh, business flow will be there what is the business flow launch login flight booking and payment logout so this one scenario will be one iteration one iteration completed again one more iteration started like again launch login flight booking logout so like this i need to execute with the 10 times that is why i'm given 10 here and once save it now you can execute now you can see the random viewer 10 times will be scriptable execute login logout login logout login logout find booking and up to 10 times it will be executed. See, 10 times it is executed. Now we can see the results, how many times we are executed, we'll see the results also. So now you can observe how many iterations we are given, 10. Each and every transaction, how many times it will happen, Launch will be 10 times happen and login 10 times and click on flights 10 times and find flight 10 times. So we can observe this is the response times of 10 users average response time. So majorly we need to give for the 
any client or if you give for the testing you are doing for the performance testing means we need to give for the this results to the customer or stakeholders to them okay we are executed at 10 users your response time is a, these are the response times we need to create one table and we need to send to them then they will observe okay 10 user test we are getting for the less than one second only we are good so uh, for just this is for the inscripting point of view we can do for the year 10 or 5 to 10 times we can do it execution point of view we can using for the controller in the controller we need to execute with the multiple users like 20 or 50 users or 2000 users 1 lakh users also you can execute is clear Yes, yes, sir. So, uh, as of now, we discussed this, right? Anyone have any doubts, please ask. So, everyone good? Yeah. Uh, in flight booking, there is no launch uh, time now. Right? You are taking, booking, you said no, no default. In results, yes, you said it's a launch time. In, in, in between, you added that launch time. I guess yeah, yeah. actually, what will happen? What will happen means uh, so when you start recording button, right? Automatically, the URL will work and launch will happen. Okay, okay. It's automatically. So that is why we are uh, we are unable to give the uh, that one. That is why I'm giving for the manual. Okay. Got it, it's right? no problem to give in manual. Yeah, manual also no problem. You can give for the manual is problem. Okay, see, this is the only six transactions. That is why you can you can give for the manual. It is fine. You can give for the okay. manual also fine. But we have the hundred transactions will be there. So you need to give for the manually which code, which one you need to find means that will be very difficult. Yes. So that is why while doing the script, you need to give for the transaction names. That is a good thing, good practice. Then okay. you not forget okay. anything. Okay. okay. How many transactions is there? We get it easy. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Someone is asking. Sir, if you want recording one user petty record this another. At a time, ten users pet record check a month petty. No, no, no need, right? Why you can do for that? Uh, we need to record only single user point of view. After that, you need to execute with how many users means you need to execute on that many. Okay, okay. So why we can record with the 10 times? 10 times means 10 users, how we can record? So in that time, it's record. only applicable. Yes, it's only we can record with a single user only. Okay. This is only for single user only scripting point of view. So we need to do some script announcements for this script. So this script will work with the single user point of view, it is fine, but multiple user point of view, it will not work. So that is why we need to do some script announcements. This script we need to ready with the multiple user point of view. So after that, the script announcements, everything is completed. The script we need to execute with the how many users you want, you need to execute that. Okay. Yes, uh, if uh, some uh, some customers have some some different uh, I mean, uh, payment methods also is different you know, there. In that time, it's a uh, test. No, I'm I'm not getting. Sorry, again, again. So payment will be different, is a different, right? See, for example, Facebook application.